It's all piano. You're right. It's all piano. This? What is this? Screeching? This is an upside down cross, maybe? Sine, cosine, tangent. Like playing a chalkboard on a turntable. Like playing a knife on a breaking rib cage. Delete her? What is this, Matt Hardy? Delete! 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 Sorry, I know it's kind of abstract. I'm just trying to, um, well, never mind. There's no point of explaining. Anyway, here's Monica's writing tip of the day. Sometimes you find yourself trying a difficult decision to try to save. Who am I talking to? Can you even hear me? Tell me you can hear me. Anything? What? Please help me? Okay. That's my advice for today. Don't take it literal. Thanks for listening. Oh, so they really want me to delete? Do they really want me to delete? Do they want me to delete Yuri from my characters list? Let's read this poem. A joke. A man walked into a club. In the club, there was a girl who liked him very much. They spent some time together. Then she liked him even more. One day, the girl realized that she was in love with him. Before disaster could happen, the third party intervened with her programming. Suddenly, the girl hated herself for being in love. This contradiction caused the script to derail. The universe started to collapse, but she killed herself just in time. Are they talking about Sayori? When did the girl realize she was in love with him? Sayori to my character. Before disaster could happen, a third party intervened with her programming. Monica will assume. Suddenly, the girl hated herself for being in love. Sayori did hate herself for being in love. She said that. She liked me more than she thought that she should. This contradiction. So contradiction caused the script to derail. The universe started to collapse, but she killed herself just in time. Okay, everyone. I still got Monica. I mean, I still got Yuri on my character list. Okay. Just checking the copyright document, too. I'm like super paranoid now. We're all done reading each other's poems, right? We have something we need to go over today, so we just sit down in the front of the room. It's about the festival, sort of. Uh, do we have to do something for the festival that we can put together in just a few days? Instead of embarrassing ourselves, that's a concern for mine as well. We don't really have the last minute preparations. Don't worry so much, we're gonna keep it simple, okay? Look, I know everyone's a little bit more lively since Turbo joined. We're gonna start some club activities, something for the time, uh, just to be complacent, uh, since we're only at four members. As the festival is our only real chance to find more, you know? That's why I love this game's reactions. <laughs> I think you're right about it. You're right about that, Andrew. I'm gonna have to start watching other people play this. The festival is only our real chance to find more, you know? So, so it's so great about getting new members anyway. We already have enough to be considered an official club. More members would just mean uh, everything gets noisier and more difficult to manage. Natsuki, I don't think you're looking at it the right way at all. Don't you want to share your passion with as many people as you can? To inspire them to find the same feelings that brought you here in the first place? The Literature Club would be a place where people can express themselves like they can't do elsewhere, anywhere else. It should be a place so intimate that you never want to leave. I know I feel the way too. She's in here. I know we all do. So we should ask, uh, work hard and put something together for the festival. Something small. Right, Turbo? Uh... Oh, come on. Don't take advantage of Turbo just agree with you just because he doesn't know what to say anything. Look, Monica, do you really think any of us here joined the club with other people in mind? Uh-oh, we're going to get a rebellion. Yuri never talked to, talked until Turbo joined. As for me, I didn't. I just liked it better here. I just like it better here than I do at home. And Turbo isn't passionate about literature in the first place. That's just everyone. Sorry... 
uh, that you're really the only one in, interested in finding new members, the rest of us are fine like it is. I know you're the president and all, and you really should consider our opinions for once. Uh-oh. Monica is clearly taken aback by Natsuki's words. That's not true at all. Piano. I'm sure Yuri and Turbo want to get more members too, right? I don't know about Yuri, but I'm kind of indifferent. If I showed much enthusiasm as Monica wanted, then I would probably be lying. Still, if it would send up to me I had to rescue the situation, um, no. Natsuki's right, isn't she? This club. It's nothing more than a place for new people to hang, for a few people to hang out. That's why I did what, what everyone here saw in the same way as I did. It doesn't mean that we're going to get new members or anything. Turbo, why don't you, why did you even join this club? What were you hoping to get out of it? Well, it's not really something I can be honest about, is it? In fact, if I remember you, you weren't even given a choice not to join. Monica sits down and stares out from her desk. What's the point of this anyway? What's the start of this club? What if starting this club was a mistake? Now you've done and now you've gone and done it, Natsuki. What me? Kind of spoke my mind. Is it a crime to be honest? It's not about being honest. It's about a word choice. Besides, you had no right to speak to everyone else in the club like that. You don't understand at all. I just I just want a place that feels nice to hang out with a few friends. Is there a problem with the club for being the... Uh, whatever. There aren't... There aren't many other places like for that for me. Now Monica wants to take it all away from me. She's not taking anything away. No, Turbo. It's not the same. It won't be the same with the same direction she wants to take it. If I wanted that, I could just have joined any stupid club. But this one... I mean... At least for a little bit of time, things were nice. Natsuki starts packing up her things. I'm going home. I feel like I don't belong here right now. Natsuki. Natsuki ignores Yuri and walks out of the classroom. This is bad. This is all bad. I don't know what to do. Well, do you have an opinion on the festival? Nah, I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent, I guess. Oh my gosh! Who cares about that obnoxious brat? Is this really Yuri saying this? <laughs> I don't... <laughs> gosh. I mean, I like how nice and quiet the club is right now. And I'm just happy... I'm just happy with you here. But still... I'm the vice president, and it's not right for me to ignore my responsibilities like that. Nobody would cry if she killed herself. Oh my gosh! Don't say thing. What? What? Why? Why? Why would they show that? It's her. It did. Uh, does that mean like she maybe broke like a blood vessel? Like. Is that, was that the symbolism that they were showing? I should do my best to consider everyone's perspective and make the decision that's right for the club. What about you, Turbo? What do you want to get out of this club? Watch her left eye. Yuri repeats the same question as Monica. I've decided to give an indirect answer better than nothing. I think the most important thing is for everyone to get along. And for the club to provide something that you can't get anywhere else. I don't think it's about how many members, but the, rather the quality of each member. That's what will end up making the Literature Club a special place. I see. I agree with you. Each member contributes their own qualities in a special way. Oh my god, her eye is dripping blood. Is she crying blood? With each change in members, the identity of the club as a whole will change too. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. Stepping out of your comfort zone for a while. If you'd like to help Monica with the festival, then I'm on your side as well. Alright. 
Maybe we can talk. I'll talk to Natsuki tomorrow. Yuri nods. Uh, hey, Yuri? Eh? Um, I know things were a little awkward yesterday, but I feel like you deserve to know that I still think you're a wonderful vice president. And also a wonderful friend. But, Monica. I want to do everything I can to make the best club ever. Okay? Me too. Yeah. So I'll go home for today. We'll talk about the festival tomorrow. Okay. I look forward to it. Shall we go, Turbo? Um, please don't take this the wrong way, but I'm going to chat with tr a little bit of Toma. She's going to chat with me. Just to see what he thinks of this time here and all that. It's important to me as a president. Uh, Yuri looks down, a little trouble, but she doesn't protest. Okay. I trust your judgment, Monica. In that case, I'll see you two tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Phew. Things have been a bit hectic lately, haven't they? Turbo, I just wanted to make sure you're enjoying your time at this club. Really hate to see you unhappy. I kind of feel like I'm responsible for that as president. It's getting fuzzy. It's getting fuzzy. I noticed something. Hold on. Uh, window capture. Okay, whatever. And I really do care about you, you know. I don't like seeing other girls give you a hard time. With how mean Natsuki is and everything. And Yuri being a bit... A little bit, you know. Ha ha ha. Sometimes it feels like you and I are the only real people here. You know what I mean? But it's weird because all the time that you've been here, we've hardly got to spend any time together. I mean, I guess it's technically only been a couple of days. Sorry, I didn't mean to say something weird. There are some things I've been hoping to talk with you about. Things I know only you could understand. So that's why... Wait, not yet. No! So it closed on her. So Monica, I don't know, is the bad person. If she really wanted to say something to me, then what caused her to say, to do that? All right, so let's do um, Yuri again. Eternity, uh, judgment, uh, determination, universe, uh, incapable, climax, uh, sensation, vertigo. Did you see that? Hold on. See where he showed up. Look, it's busted. Look, the thing is busted. This is one 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 two zero. I don't have any more words. Um, okay, so how do we say Sayori? What were Sayori's words? Um, it's like Yuri wasn't letting her complete. Help me figure out what words are for... No. She popped up again. Uh... Okay, hold on. The 
trying to make us pick words.